welcome back welcome welcome and if you're new thank you for stopping by and checking out my video now today as you can see I was feeling a little red and wanted to do something a little you know I don't know romantic am I in a romantic mood what's happening today y'all what's going on <laughs> I don't know maybe I'm trying to get ready for Valentine's Day or something but Whatever the case, yes, I wanted to do a red look today and I wanted to use a palette that I actually just got. Yeah, I know I'm on a low buy, let's not talk about it, okay? But I purchased this Flamboyance palette and I got this actually on Amazon. It is from Delancey. They do have their own website so you can purchase their palettes and makeup and stuff from their website. But I like to buy things from Amazon sometimes just, you know, that extra security. Plus I get my two day shipment and all that stuff. So this is the palette. This is the box for the palette. As you can see, it has that red and black just kind of fiery look to it and it says flamboyance. So, you know, you need to be a little bit out there <laughs> to use this palette. No, I'm just kidding. But y'all know I like something that is a little bit flamboyant. So this is the back of the palette. As you can see, it lists the ingredients and it is cruelty free and it does have the shelf life there I'll go ahead and just have that information scrolling by while I'm talking so you can read that and just make note of it but this is what the box looks like and the palette looks just like the box so this is the palette here as you can see it has this nice shiny writing on it and it says Delancey same information on the back and it's just a nice sleek thin cardboard packaging and I'm realizing that I really like this size of palette for some reason I like the nice long rectangular palettes maybe because it's easier to hold and handle and stuff and I don't really like small palettes so this works perfectly for me but let's go ahead and take a look at this palette so there is a mirror in this palette as you can see very very nice for those of you who care about that but this is what this palette looks like, you guys. Isn't it pretty? Isn't it party? She party, ain't she? Okay, so let me just give you a closer look like I normally do. And one thing you guys know I love about this palette is that there is a black in here. I love the gold background. That just kind of adds that extra you know just elegance to this palette even though it's a lesser expensive palette I really like that there are names for these shadows and it's just a nice gorgeous rich beautiful red palette okay so you want a red look like the one I have today this one works so let's go ahead and just jump into some swatches so you can check that out about this palette is it does swatch very nicely I mean those swatches just came off like butter okay I didn't have any problems or issues with having to go over the swatches multiple times you saw it <laughs> it swatched very nicely this is a very specific palette I can't see you getting a bunch of looks out of this palette but but I like it <laughs> okay definitely like it for those red smoky eyes just a really bold red look or you can still do a nice soft daytime everyday look if you want if you want to just use these shades up here you definitely can do that this black here is very nicely pigmented i was very very careful to just barely go in to deepen the outer corners for this look using just a touch of that black because you know y'all know i can go ham so i was very very careful to use just a little bit and i love how it just deepened up the reds and just really made a nice smoky look so i like this palette 
Are there any negatives for this palette that I have? No, I honestly, no. <laughs> I don't have any negatives thus far for this first impression. I want to use it again to try and do just a nice soft, nice soft daytime look as well as a really intricate bold cut crease look. I really really like this light shade here. I have that on my inner corners as you can see it popped right away and I do love that. So my first impression you guys I would say I really like this palette just from my first time use. I love this look that he created. It's really pretty to me. <laughs> I want to sit here and just be toot my own horn. You know, I'm not like that at all, you guys. But this palette, I think, created a very beautiful red look. So hopefully you guys like it as well. But enough of that. Let's just go ahead. And if you'd like to see how I created this look today, then stay tuned because it's coming up next. <laughs> 